What's up everybody? Wolfhunter25 here with another Warframe video for another Riven Challenge. This is get three headshot kills in a single aim glide. This is extremely easy. A lot of people usually do struggle with this thinking that you might need a limbo or that you're going to need somebody's help with it. Truth is, you don't. Because you can use plenty of the beam weapons that are in the game like uh, Amprex or Ignis Wraith or Glaxion or in my case, I'm gonna be using my new core. And the reason for that is because you don't, it, the, the kills, the three headshot kills don't have to be with your primary. It can be with any weapon. Uh, so I'm gonna be using Zephyr Prime for the challenge. And the reason for that is because of her passive. Move with increased agility while airborne and fall more slowly. So you'll fall to the ground a lot slower. And that way you can line up the shot a lot easier and possibly get the three headshots. Now. I was saying that I'm going to be using my new core, but if you are somebody out there who has been playing Warframe for quite a while and you just can't quite get this challenge, um, I highly suggest using the Zenith. The reason for that is because that gun has infinite punch through. So even in the full auto mode, it has infinite punch through, but I do suggest switching it to the uh, semi-auto version or the semi-auto fire when you do use the Zenith. It, when you do use the Zenith if you have it. And just remember, you know, all, all beam weapons are definitely a good choice, and you can't use the Archipelasmo because it's a rifle ribbon challenge. I have seen some challenges for this where it's like a melee ribbon or a pistol ribbon or some other kind of ribbon in, in that particular case. So if it is that particular case, definitely use the Archipelasmo because it just the punch through on it is ridiculous. But like I said, I'm going to be using New Core along with Zipper Prime because it's going to be make, making it really easy. And there's one particular map that you're going to want to do this on where you can line up at enemies in the absolute perfect way. It's extremely easy, extremely fast. And something to note, if you take a Sentinel or a Kavat or a Kubro or whatever kind of companion with you, don't. Uh, so you can take a Sentinel with you, but don't have a weapon equipped to it. Because if it's taking out the enemies, that means it could possibly screw up your shot if you're lining up with, with one. Um, a different frame for this would be uh, Valbin or Valbin Prime. Um, any particular way of adding time to where you can line up your shot better for the three headshots and one aim glide. But I just I think Zephyr is probably going to be your best bet. I've used Valvin Prime a few times, and let me try and see if there's any other frames that would be good for it. Harrow might be a possibility because he can, he can chain any. Because like I said, there's going to be one particular map I'm doing this on. So you could possibly use Harrow. That's just a possibility because you're he can CC with his... Uh, with his chains. And maybe you could use a slow Nova because it's slowing the enemies down and, it's, and we're going to be in a tunnel. I'll show you what that's about earlier, like I said. And I think that's it. So yeah, you could use Zephyr, Nova, Harrow, possibly possibly Gara, Maybe possibly Gara with her uh, Petrify ability. Her, ma her, her mass Petrify, I'm sorry. I'm just going to be using Zephyr because like I said, this is really easy. So without further ado, the mission that you want is Ceres. You want to do Draco on Ceres. The old good old map where people used to power level their stuff. And the reason you want Draco on Ceres is because there's tunnels in this. There's tunnels like a tube that you can go into. Just wait for the enemies to come through the tube. They're going to be in a single straight line. So then that way you can get the multiple headshots with a single aim clad. So let's get right into it. I'll show you just how it's done. And here's a tunnel right down here. Doesn't look like they want to come out. Now they're going to all take cover. All right, let's see if I can... There's enough of them here. I don't know. I didn't get it. Did I get it there? I don't think I did. Nope. All right, so I got a really bad map spawn, and I could not do it on this particular tile set. I'm going to have to reset. If you get a tile set that doesn't have those tunnels, or it has the tunnel that I got, because it only had one tunnel, usually, like, there's multiple of them, you might have to reset. And see, right off the bat, here's a tunnel. They're not going to have anywhere to go this time. They're going to have to come right down here. Yeah, they're not going to have any cover this time, unless they do that. This is great AI, guys. Sounded like three headshots. Yep, I got it. <sighs> that took a little bit longer than I thought it would. I really do apologize for how long that took. But that is how you easily do it. Like, just find one of those tunnels 
and it maybe not particularly that one there is one that goes like from section to section in the map i believe on a certain particular tile set but that's how you easily do it is i probably should have taken a beam weapon like the ignis wraith or the Amphrax or something like that, the new core, it might have been the multi-shot that was affecting the headshot, because that took lo longer than normal. I honestly suggest Valve. I took Zephyr going in thinking that maybe that would have been the easiest, but I've actually done it much easier with uh, Valvin or Valvin Prime. I'm going to abort the mission because once you unlock the ribbon, you can just quit the mission anyways. So hopefully it's something good. Probably won't be. Hind. <laughs> garbage yeah that's how you easily do that guys definitely use valvin or valvin prime but the bastille um with valvin you want to use you want to get you want to have long duration and a good amount of range so that way you could possibly line up the shots a lot easier but that's definitely the map you want to go to there might be different methods to doing it but uh yeah that's how you easily do it guys if you have any comments or questions leave them in the comment section below i'm going to leave a link to my twitch channel in in the description i do giveaways Every single Sunday, I'm on the Xbox One platform. I'm Master Rank 24. My gamer tag is the exact same as the YouTube channel if you would like to add me. I think I've got a motto for my outros for my videos. How about stride proudly and howl loudly? Try saying that five times fast. <laughs> Sorry if it feels like this video was uh, kind of long. It just took me a while to get those three headshots. But again, I really hope that you all found this useful. See y'all later. Bye.